Hi, I'm Marie Antoinette. I was born on November 2, 1755, in Vienna, Austria. I was born into the House of Habsburg, a prominent European royal family, and was the youngest daughter of Empress Maria Theresa of Austria. I was married off to Louis Auguste, the Dauphin of France, at the age of 14, as part of a political alliance between Austria and France. Upon the death of Louis XV, I and my husband became the King and Queen of France. I and Louis XVI had four children together. Marie Thaise Charlotte, born in 1778, she was the eldest child and the only one to survive into adulthood. After the fall of the French monarchy, she was known as Madame Royal. Louis Joseph, born in 1781, he was the second child and the heir to the French throne. Unfortunately, he died at the age of seven from tuberculosis. Louis Charles, born in 1785, he became the Dauphin of France after the death of his older brother. However, he also died young at the age of ten during the French Revolution. Sophie, born in 1786, she lived for just under a year and died in infancy. My family played a significant role in European politics and were part of the Habsburg dynasty which was one of the most influential royal families in Europe during that era. I was an Archduchess of Austria and married Louis XVI, who later became the King of France. I became the Queen of France and Navarre in 1774. I was often remembered for my luxurious lifestyle and spending habits. During my time as Queen, I faced significant criticism and scrutiny from the French public. I was known for my extravagant lifestyle, love for fashion, and indulgence in lavish parties and amusements. My spending habits, along with the economic troubles in France and my Austrian origins, contributed to my unpopularity and fueled the growing resentment towards the monarchy. The phrase, let them eat cake, is often attributed to me, the Queen Consort of France, during the late 18th century. However, there is no concrete evidence that I actually said those words. The quote is commonly associated with me as a symbol of my indifference and insensitivity toward the suffering of the French people. The phrase itself originated long before me, Marie Antoinette's, time and was attributed to a great princess in Jean-Jacques Rousseau's autobiography, Confessions, which was published in 1782, several years before the French Revolution. Rousseau mentions that this princess, whose identity remains unknown, suggested that if the people had no bread, they should eat brioche, which is a type of rich bread made with eggs and butter. I became the target of public discontent during a time of economic hardship and social inequality in France, leading up to the French Revolution. While I did face criticism for me lavish lifestyle and perceived extravagance, it is unlikely that I ever uttered the phrase, let them eat cake. The attribution of the quote to me, Marie Antoinette, is believed to be a fabrication or a misinterpretation of the historical context. The French Revolution erupted in 1789, driven by widespread discontent and socio-economic inequality. As the revolution progressed, the monarchy was overthrown, and me and Louis XVI were captured. We were both imprisoned and put on trial for treason. I was found guilty and executed on October 16, 1793 at the age of 37, at the Place de la Revolution in Paris, 